And today I want to show you how to do one of these tissue boxes and they are very very simple to make um, Everything is really inexpensive and you can probably do this within maybe like 10-15 minutes I asked you guys if you guys want to see a DIY video on this from my vanity tour Which I will link down below and you guys said yes, so I'm excited to do this for you Okay, so before I begin I want to show you guys what I did last night and I pierced my own ear I don't know if you can see it, but I'm kind of proud of myself because I I'm not good with pain and I was able to survive through that but I just wanted it pierced so desperately that I was like you know what I'm just gonna do it and I don't know if you can see it can you, can you guys see it like I pierced this second one right here I already have this first one but I pierced the second one and I was like very like um good with like sanitizing everything and stuff like that so um because I'm really worried about getting an ear infection or anything like that because that stuff is like nasty <laughs> No, I already have two of them that I made, and um, I can, I'm not going to show you um, how I apply it, but I am going to kind of guide you and tell you how I did it, because I already have two and I don't need any more, um, but it's really simple. So what you want to do first is you want to get one of these tissue boxes, and it is this is actually without the ribbon and without all the rhinestones. It's just a very simple, plain white tissue, tissue box, and if you ignore the ribbon, this is what it looks like. It's just plain white. And and um, I got this one from Target less for less than $10. So you can pick up whatever color they have. And I also wanted the top right here to be a silver finish. It's not real silver, obviously. But I wanted it to be like a silver finish because I don't have any gold in my room. So I needed something that matched my room. So you want to look out for details like that when you're picking out your tissue box. And then what I did, I went ahead and I applied. The only supplies that you're going to need to do your tissue box is to get a ribbon like this. Um, whatever ribbon you'd like, just make sure that it's a wide enough ribbon so that it looks prettier on your box. You don't want a skinny little ribbon on there. And then you just want to get some rhinestones. And I live by these rhinestones. I use it to customize pretty much anything in my house because it matches. And um, I get a lot of questions on where I get these. And I, I, you can find them pretty much anywhere. I know they sell them really, really cheap at Walmart for like $5 for a box. And I've just accumulated so many of them that I decided to put it in this bin that I got at Target for like a dollar or something like that. And then you can find them at Joan Fabrics, at Michael's. You can find them pretty much anywhere. So any craft store will carry the rhinestones. And all I did was um, put tied the ribbon around here and I'll show you guys how I did that I just put the ribbon on the back now this isn't it but I don't have one to show you with that's that's all uncustomized I guess so let's just pretend that the black ribbon isn't there and what I did is I just wrapped it around and then I made a knot and then I slowly made a bow like this it's not perfect but then once I did the bow I went ahead and I just cut the edges to make it look really nice and clean and then I'll show you where I glued it to make this bow stand out a lot better I just glued it behind here over here in the back so it stands up a little bit behind there so it stands out nice and pretty and the glue that I used was just a glue gun it's really really simple um, you can find a glue gun pretty much anywhere and I just put a little pieces right here and there and then I also put it in the back I didn't put it on the sides and then for the rhinestones all I did was I grabbed my glue gun and I put small dots and then I went ahead and I placed the rhinestones right away so it was really really simple like I said it took no time at all and I just think it looks really cute and they both match um, my my decor like I said so you can choose whatever colors you like so that is pretty much it it's really really simple um, if you guys do one of these tissue boxes please send me a picture on my Twitter Instagram or email me or anything like that because I love to see the things that you guys um, recreate or that I've inspired it to do because it motivates me to do more videos like these and, and stuff like that and if you guys already send me some pictures thank you so much and I will definitely post them on my next monthly favorites video so that is all and I'll see you guys in my next video thank you for watching bye